sunken temple, huh? Boy, wouldn't it be something if it were real? I don't know who'd actually want to live there, though. What's that? You'd like to know more about the sunken temple? Oh, I'm so sorry, but I'm afraid there just isn't much I can tell you. I've met all sorts of visitors here during my lifetime, but you're the first to ever ask me about the sunken temple right off the bat. Sunken Temple? Oh yeah, everyone around here's heard about it. But since no one's ever been there, who can say if it actually exists? Well, it sounds like everyone's heard about the temple we're after. Thing is, none of these people have actually been there. What'd you expect? It's the Temple in the Deep. You think people would call it that if it was swimmable? From the look of it, the train probably doesn't stop there either. Huh? Pan... to logist. Always here to assist? Wow! A person that studies the pants? They think of the everything! Yeah, pants must be serious business. It's pantologist, dummy. The prefix is pan. Cookware, huh? Neat! Not those pants! As in all! Like, they do a little of everything. Oh. Well, if they do a little of everything, then... Maybe they can do a little of helping us get down to that sunken temple. Let's hit the pants! W wait Lon! That looks like the place. The test will surely end in success. <laughs> oh. Was I a quart of ingredients short? Service, please! Lon, ever heard of manners? Who goes there? Oh my, I rarely cross paths with a giant bear. So tell me. Are you the Pan Mighty person from the ad? Yes. That's the gist. How can I assist? The Sunken Temple? Yes. I don't know, maybe you could give us a magic spell? You know, something that lets us breathe underwater? Maybe some magic pants? Breathe underwater? Whether it's gills or spells you want, a solution can be met, but... The sea is its own kind of hell. You're almost certain to regret. The currents will leave you blind. And it's so big you'll be bored out of your mind. Th that's discouraging. Well, hang on. We can handle a little certain regret. Uh, yeah. If you know a solution, then we'd really appreciate it if you could help us out. So come on, please. Hmm. Well, if you're quite certain that that is your desire, perhaps you're just what I require. Excuse me? Excellent! We'll start with the dunce. <laughs> you see, you can't do two total losers at once. Do to him. The bear 
breathe air. He simply can no longer breathe air. Why not? Oh, come now. Darling, use your head. You wanted to swim like the fishes, you said. But a fish out of water is soon to be dead. Are you some kind of murderer? Oh, my. After I do you a favor, this is how you choose to repay me. My dear, don't make me angry. Her magic power is the incredible! Brain, maybe you should consider the apologizing? What? I got this. I... she... Please forgive me. No! Look at that! Oh, you've decided to awake. Well, off you go with these two flakes. You got it! ocean and we're actually breathing I hope you like it cuz we can't breathe anywhere else don't you worry I've been to the sunken temple a bunch of times but just a minute does this mean we can't return to Ninewood Hills oh you can still go the back there hey I didn't know you could breathe underwater too the confusing me with your average mortal. I'm special. Okay, but then why didn't you just go to the temple for us? What? Are you the crazy? Every the inch between us and that key is crawling with the mirage of mirages. I mean a barrage of mirages. If you sit me in there alone, I'd get annihilated. Sorry. So, did you mean it when you said that we could go back to Ninewood Hills? Well, that place isn't just immune to the time. It can dispel the magic and other mystical manipulations. So, that means you can go back to Ninewood Hills without the choking to death. Thank goodness. Although, I guess that means we won't be able to travel anywhere else, huh? Eh, let's just finish our dunk to the Sunken Temple and... Wait, if we find the key, will we change back? Oh, don't worry. Dr. Shantoto gave me the antidote to the curse. Oh, what a relief. I thought we'd end up stuck like this. Wait, did you say curse? Dude! Cha. I mean, curses are the doc's specialty. Uh, first, we've heard of that. 
Well, as long as she's planning on fixing us up. Sorta. You see, the doc said, tell those twin losers the antidote costs. So bring me a Quacho Ruby or they can get lost. So good luck. I'm not crossing her. She said all that? Twin losers? What? Where did she get off calling me a loser? Lon is the loser here. You're mad about the name calling? Question for you. What the exactly is a Quacho Ruby? Oh, good point. What is a Quacho? A Quacho? Oh, there's some right over there. Their queen cries red tears, which are called Quacho Rubies. Now I see. But those sound like they must be just about impossible to get. True enough. They say she only sheds one tear every decade. The rubies go for at least a hundred million gil. A hundred mil? Uh, I swear, that is the last time I ever consult a pantologist. Hey, uh, Titus, how come you can breathe underwater? Well, if you've tossed enough blitz balls around... Eh? What? Hmm... Eh, I'll tell you about it some other time. Okay, I'll be waiting back at the surface. Good luck finding that Quacho Ruby. Yep, got it covered. Hey, just don't forget why we originally came here. You know, if we found enough of them, we could all be filthy stinking the rich. Oh, I like your style, Tama. Hear that? We're gonna find a Quacho zillion rubies. I'll say it again. Don't forget why we're here. Let's just find the key, get the ruby we need, and trade for the antidote. Rubies, rubies, baby, I wanna be a Quacho zillionaire. Let's make this good. Dude, it's on.
ought to do oh, it. Yeah. that mean we're not underwater anymore? Then that means the curse has been... Oh. Okay, wishful thinking. Right. But like, shouldn't we be floating? Hmm... I think that this temple must have some kind of special the power. Don't ask me the how it works, but I sense some kind of force that keeps people and mirages from the drifting too far away. Hey, you're right. Something's keeping us way down. But on the bright side, it's just like being on solid the ground. That's especially the helpful for you two, right? Also, this is just the wild guess, but... Whoa! No way! In some areas, the walls have their own the gravity, which lets us do cool the stuff like this. We got this. I Admit, it is. I'm a ninja. Watcha! I'm pretty sure ninjas are supposed to be quiet. Remember why we're here. To the find that ruby! Baby! I don't want No, it was something about a key. No, it was something about a key. Looks like I'm top pom pom, Koopa. No, it was something about a key.
Let's begin. Oh yeah! 